Hello, I'm David Thornton, and this is the Glion Dolly foldable electric scooter. This thing is really nice. It's put together well. I'm telling you, it's heavy enough, you can tell that the quality's there. There's no spot welds, it's all continuous welds, but it's light enough that you can put it in your car or move it around the house or whatever you need to do with it. It's got all rubber tires, so you don't have to worry about a flat or anything. And the 225 has got a couple of upgrades that are really nice. Uh, one is it's got shock, a spring on the front suspension now. It makes it ride a whole lot smoother on rough surfaces. And the other thing is the rear fender now is a brake. You just press down on it with your foot while you're riding and you got a backup manual brake other than the electric brake that's built into the handlebar. Okay, it works with the electric motor. It's just an electric brake. It works great, but now the 225 has got the upgraded fender brake in the back. It's great for backup, and it also helps you slowing down if you're on a steep hill or something. Anyway, it, it works good. It's a good upgrade. So, the foldable dolly is great. It's got a lever right here that works to unfold and fold. You use the same lever. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna set it here and we're gonna put our foot on the lever, raise it till it snaps. You wanna hear that snap because that means it's locked in good and it's safe to operate. So then we wanna fold our handlebars up till they lock in. And then you just need to adjust the handlebar heights to your needs. For me, I'm going to raise it up. It's got two notches that'll come up. I'm going to raise it up one notch. Real easy to do. And we're pretty much ready to go. Now it's got a little kickstand in the back here that you can put down. And if you ever take off and you hear a weird noise, it's probably because you left the kickstand down. But just stop, put it up, you're good to go. So, and here's the brake I was telling you about on the rear fender. And it, it, it works good, it helps. So, now you're ready to go. All you gotta do is press the red button for a couple of seconds till it comes on. And then this is your throttle. You can turn your throttle here. Same thing on the other side, but this is your electric brake. So, you get ready to go. You gotta give it a little bit of push. You gotta, it's gotta be rolling just a little bit before it'll take off. But once you have it turned on, just give it a little push and, and give it the throttle and you're good to go. So now we want to fold it back up and it's just as easy to fold as it was to unfold. So first thing we want to do is let our handlebars back down to the lower position. Turn it off if you have it. And then we slide the little tubes out here, fold the handlebars in, and the same lever down here that we use to unfold it, we're going to use to fold it back up. So just press on it till it unlocks and just and just let it down and then you can stand it up into the standalone position. The standalone position that you can get out of the dolly is uh, the Glion is nice because it takes up a lot less space. You can put it in the hallway or a closet or if you go into a, a, a business or whatever, uh, fold it up, pull the uh, luggage handle out to whatever your needs are and just tilt it back on the two little wheels in the back and you're good to go. Did you know Glion was the only scooter brand with the folding feature? Who wants a scooter that won't fold up? Just saying. Alright, I kind of showed you how to operate it, how to unfold it and fold it back up and all that, but I'm going to give you a little bit closer detail on some of these things. Now, I didn't tell you about the LED light. The LED light works great as far as lighting the way in front of you, and you control it with the red power button. Once the unit is on and ready to go, then the red button just toggles the LED light on and off. So, and as you can see here, this little uh, rubber cushion to where the spring is, the suspension addition on the 225 really makes it ride a lot better. And you can see the rear brake here. Like I said you can tell there's a groove, some tread on it for your uh, foot. 
and you just just step on that and it definitely assists in the braking so anywho this is the glion dolly model 225 foldable uh, electric scooter it's a really nice product now you can charge this in about three and a half hours the charging port is right here you just plug the charger that comes with it in right there and it'll have a light on it that'll it'll turn blue when you first plug it in and then go red if it's charging and turn green when the charging is done with this thing fully charged i have ridden it a solid two hours at a time with, without stopping it and it still had power left so you know if you're on a really steep grade a lot maybe a little bit less but it it runs i got some grade here where i ride and it, it does a really good job i'm surprised how long it will last so uh, anyway i appreciate you watching the this is the glion dolly model 225 foldable electric scooter once again it's a really nice product and thank you for watching my review thank you